Hello there, Draymond's Knowledge on tour. Come to a local place that's uh, got night, uh, winter lights for the children and families. Beautiful Rosemore. So my mate behind me I've made. I'm doing a on the road one, layer cake, brew dog beer. This is a marshmallow and chocolate stout and uh, brew dog is a brewery that I will go on about when I stitch this together when I get home. So we've got the layer cake here, chocolate and marshmallow. Got it in my portable Pilton mug here. It's an absolute treat. It is so nice. Let me see if I can get any of these lights in the background on. Beautiful lights and an angel there behind me. Andrew Gabriel himself. This is such a beautiful drink. I apologise for the uh, graininess of this video, but there's not much light in here. So I'll stand next to my mate, the naked man. Um, right, anyway, this beer is so delicious. Lovely winter drink, a bit tasty. I'll give that an 8.5. All the best everyone, uh, Merry Christmas to all, feeling a lot better after my, uh, let's get him in the background, old Angel Gabriel, after a problem with my teeth had to go on antibiotics but uh, that course has run and I'm back on it, in time for the Christmas special, all the best everyone and I'll stitch this together with all the facts later on, <laughs> here we are folks, back home, so I'm going to finish off this brew dog review, the layer cake that I enjoyed at the uh, Winter Wonderland, a place called Glow, which is uh, Rosemore, which is an RHS garden place in uh, near where we live, had a lovely winter display, and this beer was a lovely accompaniment. Marshmallow chocolate stout from the brew dog boys, seven percent in volume. Now, as I'm sure a lot of you craft beer fans and beer drinkers will know brew dog is a major success story started in scotland in aberdeenshire two lads in their early 20s decided they're gonna have a crack at the craft beer market and they haven't looked back famously rejected by dragon's den over here didn't even make the tv they just got through to the um sort of a screen test and they decided no not good enough it's not different enough and uh, who's laughing now now Dra dragon's den is like shark tank in america and various shows like that where investors have the chance to in you know invest in these um up and coming uh, companies and they knock these boys back well many millions of pounds many billions of pints many breweries many bars and even now hotels tell a different story so hats off to them two lads still under 40 living the dream they um have got loads of beers as i said brew dog is famous worldwide now america is in ohio it's in columbus ohio i should say still in scotland a couple of breweries there in europe and australia and ships to many countries around the world um the let me just have a quick look yeah 2007 so within 13 years they've conquered the world and it just keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger um i'm sure you guys in the us have uh, heard of them and can easily get their beers and um, i suggest you really do try that layer cake that i've just had for a winter uh, seasonal drink um it was beautiful the marshmallow rich it had um a lovely head which I like, creamy all the way down, um, really nice sweet tasting stout, not over the top, you know, I've got the greatest of sweet tooths and it was just enough and as it says on the can it is like a dessert in a can so hats off to them boys, a bit of a Christmas jumper here, one of the originals when me and Marco rebooted this trend again. I just wish that he could find the one with the little skiing men that he had because that was a legendary one. Um, 
Right, all the best to everyone. Uh, I'm fully back on it now, revitalised. The old tooth down here is, uh, got to have a bit of work done to it in the new year, but the uh, abscess is under control. I'm sure you are so <laughs> really wanted to hear that. Well, uh, look, you know, Brewdog is easy to find. They do wonderful beers. I've reviewed another one of theirs in the past. Um, they're in Weatherspoon's pubs over here with their brew punk and um, it's a lovely beer and in Scandinavia that's the number one beer so uh, they've done fantastically well so get out get some good stouts inside you get some other beers of them inside you have a jolly holly Christmas and uh, look out for the Christmas special two three days away and then after that we might even do a drunk one what a treat anyway all the best everyone see you soon if you can't be good as the captain says don't be bad but if you can't be bad be good how about that a little christmas cheer nicking off the captain himself all the best everyone godspeed <laughs>